Hey, what's up? This is Pastor Conrad. I'm standing here with my buddy Michael Heineman. We're about to just uh, make him the guinea pig of a new group called Real Men. What it means is uh, there are men that are relational, relational, encouraging, accountable leaders. And that's what we're trying to do is raise up real men of God. Tonight, we're going to seal the deal by baptizing him in the cold Beaufort River. Yeah, now, here's cold. the thing with it being cold. Sometimes your walk with Christ isn't very comfortable. That's why we have a comforter. Let's get it in. Woo! Why, why did I want to do this? Whoa! Ah, uh, you got to go. Can you still see me? Yeah, keep going, keep yeah, going. You got it. <laughs> well, all right. My brother Mike here has confessed his faith in Jesus Christ. So we are baptizing him according to the profession of his faith. And right now we do it in front of these other men of God right here. Um, you can't see him behind you, that's okay. We have some other men of God and we're baptizing him in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit tonight. And Jesus is going to wreck his life for his good and God's glory. I'm sure. Hey, you turn this way? Alright, ready? Mike, according to your profession of faith in Jesus Christ, is Lord and Savior, I'm going to baptize you now in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Woo! Woo! Yeah! Woo! 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 That's got to be cold. <laughs> Amen. Put your glasses on? Yeah, man. Jesus is going to heal my eyesight now um, on camera. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> it should be close. He's still getting this. Got him? Dang it, Jesus. Amen. Woo! I thought you were going to heal me right there. It's not as cold as Can I see? Can I see? No. Nope. You know, I think I should just dump these towels into the water. Nope. <laughs> sir. You really don't like me, do you, Mike? <laughs> Dear Heavenly Father, we just thank you for our brother in Christ. God, I just ask right now, Lord Jesus, that you would just begin a mighty work in his life. God, Philippians 1, 6 says, you who began the good work will finish what you started, God. So we just ask right now, Lord, that as we just baptized our brother in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, that now he is in your hands, God. We ask right now, Lord Jesus, that you would fill him with your Holy Spirit. God, we pray, Lord, that you would just, just come and wreck his life, God, for, for his good and your glory, God. We're so desperate for more of you, God. I pray right now, Lord, as these men of God surround him, he knows he has brothers in the faith encouraging him to live the life that he's been called to live, God, urging him to live the life worthy of the calling he's received in Christ Jesus. God, we ask right now, Lord, that you would help our brother to flee the youthful lust and to pursue righteousness, faith, love, and peace along with those who call on the Lord out of a pure heart. We thank you, Lord, for what you're doing amongst us, in us, and through us. It's in your holy and precious Son's name we pray. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Welcome to the family. 